In this presentation, we will see the various materials or the surfaces used in pharmaceutical industry. Two grades of stainless steel, that is SS304 and 316, has become popular in pharmaceutical applications because of their properties such as high strength, corrosion resistance, nature, and affordability. Alphabet L in SS316L stands for low content of carbon. Due to the addition of molybdenum element, SS316 steel has greatly improved its corrosion resistance and high temperature resistance properties. SS316 and 304 are ANSI and NSF approved for food contact as they have the same minimum chromium content. Next is glass. Glass is virtually inert and impermeable, making it the most stable of all packaging materials. Its high transparency allows easy inspection of its content. It is chemically resistant to most of the medicinal products. Glass used for pharmaceutical containers is either borosilicate neutral glass or soda lime silica glass. Glass is also classified as USP type 1, type 2, type 3 based on the intended use. Rubber stoppers or closures, rubber gaskets and rubber gloves are commonly used in pharmaceutical industry. The main types of rubbers used in pharmaceutical products include natural rubber, neoprene, natrile, butyl, chlorobutyl, bromobutyl and silicon. Out of these, silicon is the most expensive and the most inert one. Next is aluminum. Due to superior barrier properties, aluminum foils remains the material of choice for pharma packaging. Impenetration to moisture, oxygen and other gases as well as the microorganisms and light, aluminum foil helps to keep medications in perfect condition for a longer time. Next is silicon. Silicon has the ability to withstand sterilization processes. The delivery of favorable test results regarding extractable substances and the absence of animal derived ingredients. Silicon provides excellent biocompatibility and chemical inertness to maintain the purity of sensitive fluids. For pharmaceutical and biotechnology applications, platinum cured tubings is the exceptional choice for fluid transfer. It offers high temperature resistance and fewer potential leachables. Next is low density polyethylene and high density polyethylene. They are commonly known as LDP and HDP. The leading applications of LDP and HDP in the medicinal industry today are the ophthalmic containers that is bottle and cap, cuvettes and tubic connectors but it also used to produce test kits, syringes and surgical tests. Plastic provides a cost effective and reliable form of packaging for products in a variety of industries including the pharmaceutical sector. Here we have covered key materials or the surfaces used in pharmaceutical industry. Subscribe to channel for more informative videos on pharmaceutical industry.